Uh, that's what I'm going to work with right there. And, um, I mean, it's pretty much self-explanatory there. The only thing that's come to come to question in this in this project right here is uh the two the two pieces the two pole pieces right there that I'm machining uh they actually in my I, I was the initial thinking was I should weld those pole shapes to the cross arms right there and um uh, I'm sh I'm not sure that they do need to be welded, but uh, yeah, you know, I was thinking TIG welding would be the, the proper way to do that. But I don't have a TIG machine, so you know, I could MIG them. I put uh, get out that buzz box there and uh, zap them with some seventy eighteens, I guess. But but it, it, this is the project in hand, and. Uh, I'm going to do saw him off right there. You know, sacrifice one of them inner cores right there. Uh, and the way it worked out, you do need both radiuses in order to do these couple little add-ons right there. Brilliant idea to saw that off. Laminated. Should work perfect, I think. I will build that test machine right there. That's what the mechanism will look like. I will stick a torque wrench in that sawed off socket welded to that offset. Kind of straight line pendulum effect if we can get it. Well, you know what? If you do the math on that little sketch right there. Yeah, 1963 Chevrolet Impala. That's that front part there goes behind your bumper, underneath your grill. Oh, yeah. Well... Here, Wolfman Jack coming out of them speakers, you know? Yeah. 
Wolfman Jack on the radio. That's what I'm talking about. Turn your radio on there if you want some music in the background.
we'll get a bigger hammer on that.
Oh, yeah. Now we'll get that on that car over there. And we'll take the grinder of that now and see what we got to work with. It's straight enough. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> and we'll take the war wheel to this. War wheel it down. And then we'll put some out there rust converter on it. I'm going to try that uh, rust -oleum, uh spray can rust converter. And then we'll put some satin black on top of that. <laughs> You know, if it ain't right, don't turn it in for grade. That'll be all right right there. Ford part, Chevrolet part. <laughs> <laughs> 